another empties video and I love filming these videos. I don't know why, they're one of my favorites to film. I had a bag full of stuff and I just put it onto my table so I wouldn't be rummaging around uh, looking for stuff to empty and I just dropped something. So well, let's empty that item first. And the first item that I'm emptying is the 117 Ardell Lashes. You know what, there was nothing special about them. Would I repurchase them? Probably not. Well, there's just nothing special about them. The next item that I have, the Secret Minerals from the Dead Natural Body Lotion. Now these guys sell their stuff at stalls at malls. Stalls at malls. And I got this from my mother. We were walking around and the person, you know, they sometimes yell at you when you're walking by, happened to grab my mom's attention and convinced her to buy this. And it came with the nail kit as well and it was really expensive. I want to say it was ridiculous. But somehow, they like washed her arm and everything. They convinced her that this product was good. So she picked up two sets, one for herself and one for me. Um, I just never really liked it. So the next item that I'm emptying is the Vita Gentle Aloe Facial Scrub. I actually liked this one. I did not like the other Davita stuff that I was trying. This was the only product that I thought was good at exfoliating my skin in the mornings. Would I repurchase this though? No. Another kitchen mandarin that I finished. I like the scent. I hope that this is not discontinued and just seasonal, something like that. That's what I have to say about that. Um, this is the Olay Body Quench Body Lotion. This is for extra dry skin. Ooh, it's like starting to squirt out. Um, but I don't like this. I don't like the smell. I just, I don't know. I just don't like it. Bye bye. Uh, this Thayer's Unscented Witch Hazel is my husband's empty. Now, in one of my videos, I purchased a ton of these because I said he goes through these really quickly. So I asked him to give me his empty witch hazel so that I can kind of keep track of how fast he uses these because it feels like he goes through them pretty quickly. I take like half a year to finish one of these and I feel like he uses these once a month. We will definitely continue to buy this stuff because I love it too. The next item that I'm going to empty is this Equate Anti-Cavity Mouthwash, and this is the purple kind, my favorite, keeps my teeth from feeling sensitive, yes I will continue to repurchase. Here is another one of these Essence of Beauty face brush cleaners. I don't know why I went crazy and bought a ton of these when they were being discontinued or clearancing. I don't like them, but I'm going to finish them off. Um, just like these yucky razor blades from Venus, the Spa Breeze, I hate those, but I will finish them off. Unfortunately, I bought a huge pack of them, so I still think I have a couple months of having, a couple more months of having to use this yucky stuff. Next item I have is the chocolate chip Enjoy Life cookies. I actually like these. There wasn't anything special about them except for the fact that they are gluten free. So if you are gluten free, uh, you might want to keep that in mind. This is the CVS body wash that was free. Um, this is the Energize and there was nothing really special about it. I think I bought it just because it was free. Good for a summer scent, but nothing special like I said. The next item is this White Lucent Shiseido Brightening Refining Softener. This sample was a little bit too small for me to see whether or not there was any brightening properties. I probably wouldn't buy this again because it's not natural and I'm trying to switch my skincare to natural. I received these Sephora Cream Instant Moisturizers, two of them. Um, I'm not sure, like in little kits that they gave us. I did not like this at all on my face so I use this on my body. Bath and Body Works Aromatherapy Detox Therapy. This. So felt kind of oily. I used it as a foot scrub. I did like the scent. It was kind of like lemongrass. I don't even know if Bath & Body Works sells this anymore, so I can't really comment on if I would repurchase. If they had it, I would probably not repurchase. Telescopic L'Oreal Mascara. This is the one with the funny wand. 
Now I absolutely love this. I would repurchase it except it has been discontinued but I found this at a discount store, GTM in San Diego, and I bought a backup of it. This one is just perfect I feel like for grabbing your lashes in the corner. Next one that I have is the Maybelline XXL Pro. These are both waterproof. I did not like this one. I felt like this one gave me raccoon eyes, smudged the primer on it wasn't good. So no, I would not repurchase that one. Um, I know I had another mascara here that I finished off. This is the Maybelline Lash Discovery in waterproof. I really liked this. This was an Emily Noel inspired purchase. I do have a backup of it and I would continue to purchase this. Pur purchase this. I put this on both my top and my bottom lashes. It's a drier formula which I liked and I felt like this did not clump. This was tiny and I also liked that because it was tiny it gave me a little bit more control. This is the Bliss All Around Eye Cream. Now this probably this tiny little sample lasts me over a week and a half but I didn't really feel like I noticed any sort of benefit or change so I would not purchase the full set. Cotton balls, they're one of my favorites, they're from Target. Off this is Vega One All-in-One Nutritional Shake. I didn't like this, this tasted weird. This After I drank this I had like a weird aftertaste the whole rest of the day. I felt like I could smell it. Now it didn't smell that horrible. I can still remember what it smelled like. It's hard to explain. Like really earthy even though it was a vanilla shake. autumn I have is the Essential C Day Moisture from Murat. I love this stuff and you will see this in a future Sephora haul, future or past Sephora haul, whichever comes up first. Um, love it, would repurchase it, have repurchased it. Omega Kids Swirl Fish Oil. This actually tasted pretty good, it surprised me. Um, yeah, it was a kids supplement for Omega. Omega-3 and DHA. And the next two items are these Epiel Vitamin C and Aloe Vera wipes. I liked the Vitamin C wipes. The aloe Vera, they're just okay. I might save these two and do like a comparison video of all the Epiel wipes once I've tried all the ones that I purchased because if you watched my Big Lots haul, I bought a ton. Facial clay spa mask. I received this in a swap. I was not too crazy about it. I actually felt like it irritated my skin a little bit. So after using this, I kind of, I'm kind of going away from face masks now because I feel like face masks dry out my skin. Maybe I'm using the wrong kinds. I don't know. I'm just not doing them for now. Too Faced Shadow Insurance Primer. This took me two years to finish. Two or three years to finish. Finally, I am done. I Maybe I would repurchase, but right now I don't think I need to because eye primer seems to last forever. Relata Pomegranate Regenerating Body Lotion. I like this. I like fruity smells, I guess. And then here is the Buddy Wash. I'm about to try this Buddy Wash Lavender and Mint Shampoo and Conditioner on Ralph. So let's give it a go. Going to open up this where Ralph already is. Hey, Ralph, you ready for a bath? You ready for bath time? Here goes napping. I have not yet lathered it into his fur. I just kind of put it on top, and I'm about to lather it. it smells pretty pleasant, but Ralph, it's okay. It's just bath time, and let's see how it works. Right about now, Ralph is trying to find a way to escape the bath. No. Don't jump out! <laughs> she usually does a lot of leaking over the bathtub. Ah! He goes a little bit crazy. Ralph, come back! <laughs> what kind of neck dance are you doing? Huh? What kind of neck dance are you doing? Ralph got a bath and he smelled excellent afterwards so maybe I would buy this one 
The skin didn't seem to be irritated, so I liked that as well. Get keratin hair volumizer. These were pretty huge pills to swallow. I think I prefer my Costco hair and nail pills more. Um, so that is my empties video. Thank you all for watching and see you next time. Bye!